As schools around the nation are scrambling to figure out what the school year will look like, here in Wairika, school's already started, and the principal has placed protocols so that students and faculty can stay safe in in-person classes. It told me um, everything we're doing hasn't been done before. Mark Greenfield is the superintendent and principal for Wairika High School. Since May, his team has been working together, planning what the current school year will look like. The most important thing is that we are providing a good education and that has to be provided on campus and off. And we didn't know what that was going to look like. They decided for their nearly 700 high school student population, a mixture of both online and in-person learning. Each student was assigned a red day and a gold day, which allows students to get the best of both worlds with the intent of limiting their potential exposure to COVID-19. Obviously, nobody gets it all right. We're having to fine tune things, but overall, I think my staff, teachers and admin, we did a pretty good job of dotting all the I's and crossing all the T's. One of the reasons staff members pushed for in-person classes was the concern for students' mental wellness. Just talking to kids, they want to be on campus and they don't care, you know, they're going to comply with whatever it takes for them to be here. Staff tell me they had their doubts, but students are actually making their job a little easier. I thought it might be a nightmare trying to get them to, you know, social distance and to wear their masks and stuff. But, um, I think across the board, they, they understand that they've got to wear their masks, play the game, to be able to be here. In Wairika, Katie Strait, NBC5 News.